In my mind, LeBron James is the greatest basketball player who ever lived, ever played. Never saw Michael Bigger, Jordan. stronger, faster. Hey. He never saw Jordan. And, 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 oh, okay, I, I get, and everybody's, everybody's fight with LeBron is that he doesn't have the killer mentality. If he gets a championship, which I expect next season, mm -hmm. with Anthony Davis, I'm putting him on the Mount Rushmore. Stop it's going to be impossible. For one championship. One, one championship, championship on the Lakers, and he's on I know, the Mount Rushmore. You, know you know why you think that? You played for the Clippers. They've never made a conference. No. Lakers have 16 chips. Not, not for chip. one. If he wins three in a row, yes. Can't be on the Mount Rushmore after you win one. You can't do it. I, I, if if he gives it. a one and the difficulty no. and what then he why has to go Shaq, through. Okay, then why isn't Shaq on? Will, Hold on. You said, you said uh, uh, LeBron James, the greatest player ever? Ever. What about Michael and Kobe? So you're just going to pass Kobe up like that? I'm going I'm to I'm pass Kobe up. I'm going to look at Michael. I'm going to look at the... <laughs> I'm going to look oh, at the... Oh, <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. Patron America. Yo, yo. Patron America. You, Kobe you. Bryant couldn't feel, or Michael Jordan feel LeBron's shoes. The impact that he's had with different teammates, would different you organizations. Mad, would you be mad at me if I just walked off the you show? You can't leave. Would hey, you, any other you, circumstances. Are you aware that this man that has tripled type. and doubled Michael Jordan in assists? I'm gonna Assists say, make other players better now. I'm going to say one thing to you. And okay. Max, I don't know the numbers like you do. Michael Jordan is what in the finals? Six and what? Oh. And what is LeBron in the finals? That's all I got to say. Shaq, how many, did game, how many times did MJC the Warriors, though? Oh, I'm glad you brought that up. Will you stop it? I'm, I'm, glad, I'm just Shaq, saying, though. Shaq, Shaq, stop it. Shaq. He's going to beat the Warriors? Hold He's going to beat Shaq. KD, when Jordan Steph, retired. Clay? When Jordan yes. retired. No! <laughs> yes! Mm -hmm. They're going to beat that team? Yes. Because not it? to mention, they're not going to guard Rodman, and they're doubling every time, MJ. Listen, first of all, you got to hit those threes. Oh, okay. Uh, they hit them. Another, oh. another question. What era are we playing in? We playing in the big boy era where you can knock people on the ass, or we playing in this little cupcake era now I think they, where you can't touch people? These, I think Give they me an era. I think they win in both eras. Will you stop it? Oh, hold on. Hold on. Is Clay not tough? Clay couldn't play back Who, then? Whoever's paying him to say all this stuff, <laughs> Shaq, I will pay you Shaq, double who, to stop it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Shaq, 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 Shaq. How, Are the Rockets still contenders? Yes, if they play the right way. Tension is good. Besides my show, this is my favorite show. Mm -hmm. And I see you, you, well, not you, but I see you and Miss Steven, that you have tension every morning. All the stories I heard about the past grades, if they had tension, they had beef. But when you step inside the lines, you got to respect each other. So... If he just get off the ball every now and then. I don't agree. Then, Why were you able to? I don't, I don't, I don't, no, you got, no, no, no. No, no, you no, no. Keep people Here, why though? Stop Here, why though? Stop it. He can't well, take every shot. The Stop reason it. they're not contenders is because they don't have the right personnel. Are you James is it? Look, you stop it? Yo, James is a willing passer. When he passed the ball to PJ Tucker, he three and D. He either shot a rim. Then you talk about Golden State. You hit Iggy. He shot fake, rim, dribble, second, third play. Those guys you, you aren't used right. to having a basketball. Dribble and pass, not. Put it between your leg ten times and wait for the shot clock to come down. But we we played against each other a I couple did not of times. Elbow you no, up. we got to bring. He keeps the nine. What in NBA two K? No, no, no. In the game. Let me say, hey, hey, we got the video. Let me be the judge of this. What's this about, Diesel? What's what? What did I do? Oh, that's you. you that put went your boy on the floor, yo. I did not. You yeah, look. I didn't touch him. What are you talking about? Oh yes. Stop crying, Dirk oh. Nowitzki. Hey, man. So we're playing against each other. First of all, my hand is there. You just ran wow. into it. No, With no. With the elbow to the face, <laughs> so you had a big Brian one. Brian didn't a, even know you were there. What are you talking there's about? A fa hey, there's a fan that said, come on, Shaq. He said, okay. I said, oh, my God. It was accidental. I apologize. Ask Matumbo. Yeah, you're a big man. And I'm going to send you on a cruise to Russia. Hey, no. I got no. That's Ryan Hollins, by the way, in case you've never met. Why don't we wait till the end of the playoffs, finals, and everything, and then say, all things considered, who's the MVP? Doesn't have to come from the finals winner. Why are you, but why are you who's dancing around the question? The MVP. Though? Why are you dancing around the question? It's about being overrated, not an 82 game season. That's not what it's in question Therefore, right now. Therefore, what we would say after every single season is James Harden is not in the conversation for MVP. Like, I hate to break it to everyone. And Ryan Hollins. He's not a good defender. Gotten better, but still not a good defender. Uh, he he led the league in deflections. In deflections. And second yeah, he in gets, steals. He's yes. a decent. When he, he wants to be, he's a decent defender. Right. When he wants to be, he's a decent defender. He does yeah. get into passing lanes, but you can't say he's a good can, defender. Hold on. Can you? You can't neglect that.
He's, he led the league in, second in the league in steals. Is he a good defender, yes or no? He's a quality and serviceable defender. Oh, when serviceable. he wants to be. Listen. You see these words you're using? Hey, hey. The one thing about the NBA playoffs is everything gets down to details. They are going to come out and dissect your team and the personnel play by play, personnel by personnel, person by person. So when you look at James Harden, you can't just look at him and say he underachieved. They didn't have the personnel to come out and get the job done. Look. Two years ago, two postseasons ago, they had a game seven at home. No Chris Paul. James Harden, here's your chance. They went 0 for 27 at a certain point from three. It was the worst three-point shooting night in the history of basketball. Like including in rec leagues, everything. Never been a worse three-point shooting night. Many of them were. were. Those, yes. oh, no, they Many were. of them were. Many do you, of them do you were open shots. What the Golden State game plan was? Man, I, it was to usher him to the rim. So he took what the defense gave him. They literally opened the gates, Many as you saw Utah do. Shots. You know what the Utah strategy was? Where they opened the gates and said, go yes. ahead, take a layup. Many you know of them were you, open you shots. You, know you want to go back started. and look at the video? They were not. Do you know where that started? It started with the Warriors. So he took what the defense gave him. Listen, and the one thing is, if he goes to the hole, he makes the right play, and his teammates don't make plays, the personnel's not there in the same way. If he goes off the floor and Chris Paul can't make things happen like he once Boy, used that's to. That's two years ago. I'm talking about two years ago. There was no Chris Paul. He's, He's in top my top five. five. So He's in my five. Is top Kawhi five. in your top five? Yeah, it's Kawhi's okay. in the top five. Is it Kawhi? Yeah, yeah, hold on, hold on. Are we Kawhi. counting KD? Uh, because yes, you're, we're you're counting KD. Counting everything he did. KD did more in the playoffs no, 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 than no. Harden. KD, Kawhi, yeah. Bron, uh -huh. Steph Harden. Okay. I'll give you one. Okay, here we go. I am intrigued. Right? I'm not fully sold on Brooklyn right now. I'm KD not and Kyrie. Fully sold on Brooklyn. Wow. I'm not fully sold wow. on Brooklyn. KD and Kyrie is overrated. I'm not fully sold. I'm not all in. Yeah, I have I'm not all in. I, I support you walking I, I, you, away. You I'm gotta be in. kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. No, I'm not. Me. All yeah. in. I'm not wow. This isn't performance art. This isn't acting. You gotta be kidding me. You're you? all in. I'm not all in. I'm not all in. I tell you the Miami Heat trading for Jimmy Butler to be a six seven <laughs> seed is overrated. You're and you're like, that's one. nuts. And then when forced, when forced to find <laughs> look at his face. Get a, get a close up because hey. he's he, hey, your we'll ice are slipping. Well. Hey, you said KD and Kyrie to the Nets is overrated. What's your expectation? What's I don't your, need hey, to talk. On. I don't need to talk. No. Hey, let me ask you something, buddy. Let me ask you something, buddy. Open the big ears up of yours. What are the expectations for Katie and Kyrie in Brooklyn? This year? They join? No, this year? no, when Katie's back, what are the expectations? Those two playing together? Titles. Titles. When he passes the ball, he can't help if Klay Thompson ain't on the floor. He can't help if Iguodala won't even look at the rim, if Draymond Green won't look at the rim, if Kevon Looney's missing, if Bookie Cousins can't jump over a phone book, a credit card, a cell phone. <laughs> Bookie Cousins couldn't jump over a cell phone, bro. So we blame Steph Curry? Keep in mind. The shot that he missed, okay? The shot that he missed that would have extended the series out. Yeah. It was the hardest shot in basketball. My boy Kawhi Leonard dribbled around Ben Simmons. Stop Very it. good defender. Stop it. And shot the three in the eyeballs of Joel Embiid. Everybody knows world world defender. Every to hit the three to send them to the next round. What are you talking about? That horrible. The what defense, are you, you talking about? You know how bad that defense was? I saw there a lot go. of improvement in the finals from Steph in these finals. Improvement. But he ain't there yet. You have look. What is there? All, Hold on. What is there yet? He's an NBA champ. I will explain. Six foot three and under. You could argue he's the best who ever did it. Mm -hmm. And and this game selects out for height because not in your case, but most people <laughs> because you're closer to the rim. It's such a the troll. Rim. It's unbelievable. The rim, yeah, it's troll. the rim is elevated, so the taller you are, the better. Like the, it's to your advantage. Even small. Is ball. that your logic? Even small. Hold on. Is that your logic? Being taller is better. Even I said not in your case. That's your It's hard for you to. Understand. Well, first off, I want to congratulate Giannis because those believe that I've been incredibly hard on him through the whole season. But unfortunately, no, they got it wrong. He was not the MVP of the NBA. how good Giannis is. It's hard to imagine. Ryan Hollins, imagine a guy your size but really good at basketball.
Like, think about that for a second. <laughs>